Today on Spirits and Gear, we see if the Line 6 Spider 5 120 combo can do metal. I have done several videos involving Line 6 Spider combos, beginning with Spider 4 metal video. The last one was the Spider 5 video, and that particular amp was the 30 watt version, and it had the 8 inch speaker. And I openly wondered in that video how much of an improvement uh, in the tones I would see if I went to the top of the line. A combo with the full-sized 12-inch speaker and thus here we are with the Line 6 Spider 5 uh, 120 combo. This has quite a bit bells and whistles. This has XLR outs on the back, a full 12-inch speaker as I just mentioned and also with the entire Spider series they have actually alleviated my biggest complaint with the Spider series in that you couldn't use the software while also using it um, as a USB audio interface to pass audio to your computer for home recording. And I am happy to report that they actually have a standalone app for your computer to dial in tones on your desktop while recording tones and you can dial them and mess with the tones all you want while recording. With that out of the way, I think it's time to see if this thing can do some metal. Uh, for the signal chain, I am using a Lawton LA320 tube condenser microphone. Um, this little box you see here on the top of the amplifier is just the power supply for the microphone. It is going in to my STAM 1073 MPA preamp and post-processing is not a ton actually. A little bit of EQ right here and a little bit of post-processing. I'll put them right here. Uh, that is all that is done to the guitars in post. Otherwise, it is just a regular good old fashioned mix. The bass tone is from uh, Line 6 Helix's native uh, plugin. But uh, other than that, yeah, let's see if this thing can do some metal, shall we? <laughs> And there you have it. I definitely think if you're going to get a spider combo, that the full 12 inch speaker size is definitely the way to go. Um, it just has the low end, it has the resolution, and uh, yeah, that's it's pretty good. Um, I did not use the XLR outputs. Now, I could have, and that kind of would have been the easy way to go, but since I used a microphone for the last two spider combos, I figured I would just keep with that and keep it a fair comparison and still use a microphone, although I am not using the same microphone in every single video. I think they've been different for all the videos. I still think this is a pretty good representation of what the full size top of the line spider combo can do versus the entry level spider combo. I've never made any butts about it on this channel. I like the spider combos. I'm a huge fan. I always have been starting with the spider two combo that I used to kick around my old apartment. Yep. I I'm a, I'm a fan of the spider stuff. Uh, all pickable links down below in the description. You've been wonderful. I have been fluff. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.